All right, so uh, here we go. Here are the changes for D to A. First thing you're going to do is move your first finger up one string. Okay, we'll go through that like five times. And then you're going to move your first two fingers together back into the D chord shape. So make sure you're going back cleanly into the D chord shape, back and forth. Okay, and now we're going to add our third finger. So we're going into that A chord shape five to ten times, nice and clean, and then you'll strum. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So you have chord change for like two minutes, and then strum for two minutes. Make sure you're grabbing that chord tight. One, two, three, four. Uh, for, you know, like I said, two minutes, two or three minutes. And then moving from A to G. So the first finger that moves is the second finger here right there and back to the A. Nice straight path back to the A. And then the first two fingers will move back to the A. Okay, and then we add three fingers. So this third finger is going to slide down. There, slide down. Okay, and now we're going to add the pinky finger down. A string G, A string, G. So we have D, A, A, G, and it goes back to A. And then strum. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 